Hello Shatterbox! Today we're gonna have a different kind of video. Today I'm gonna teach you how to edit like Kim Kardashian. Before we start, I wanna invite you to subscribe and like this video if you want more tips on how to get the perfect photo. So now let's start. So actually, Kim Kardashian vibe, it's technically very muddy, and it has a lot of grain to it. The image can actually get that effect with Instagram tools. So I'm gonna go to my Instagram. I'm gonna select the photo that I wanna edit. So, so I'm gonna choose this photo, this selfie to edit, right? So I'm gonna crop it as I want, like you normally do on your Instagram, click next. Then you're gonna see all the filters all the option filters that you have right here so you're gonna click on Hayden that immediately is gonna give a very close looking look on how Kim Kardashian photos look that is like a very tan skin etc etc that it's very very cute and we're gonna play with the contrast so if you go to the edit side you go on edits and go hit contrast we're gonna go low on this one, so minus 40, minus 50, depending on your photo, but around those numbers. So I'm gonna go 48 on this photo. So if you hold your photo for like a second, you're gonna see the before and after, and we can already see like a more muddy look going on. Then we're gonna go on locks. So then I'm gonna click done and lux it's right here this icon and we're gonna lower it so we're gonna go minus 10 not that much so I'm gonna do so done and the last step is to go to the option faded so you will see the option right here it's like clouds and we're just going to do like a little touch in it, so maybe it's six, it's cool. Gonna click done, and then you're going to see the before and after. If you will like, I mean this photo looks pretty much at that, as that filter, but if you want to add a little bit of green to it, uh, what we're going to do is that we're going to save this photo from Instagram so I'm gonna fake that I'm posting the photo and for that I'm just gonna go to my settings and put it in airplane mode and so eliminate Wi-Fi everything so the photo is not really gonna be post and I'm gonna click next next like I'm posting but it's gonna fail and then it's gonna appear in my camera roll so you're gonna be able to see my edit photo so then I'm gonna go to Vesco app, select my photo, and there I'm gonna go to the tools, which is this little bottom right here. I'm gonna go again to the same little bottom there, and I'm gonna add some green. So you're gonna see the green option right here. So if you see if I go very dramatic, you're gonna only see like, it's like very grainy. We don't want that, so maybe something in the middle, something like this, so it looks, I'm gonna make it a little bit more dramatic so you guys can really see it on the, on the final product. But I think this is full. So I'm gonna save, save, I just save. I'm gonna save it to camera roll. And that's basically it. So I'm gonna do a before and after. So here's the difference between the original photo that I took and then this photo that looks a little bit more muddy looking, like very, very, very nice. If you like this video, don't forget to subscribe, to like, to leave your comments. If you like this process, there are many ways to get this effect. It's all about like changing light, contrast, etc. But if you have your own way to get there, let us know in the comments. If you like any other filter that you have seen 
on Instagram, let me know in the comments so I can find out how they did it and let you know. Big kisses, don't forget to subscribe, to like, to visit my online store, Brownie Flush. Love you guys, you're beautiful and special and see you next time.